you might need a bigger boat. So I've been getting some notes from HR recently that many of the Vikings feel like their personal space is being violated. Why are you the way that you are? And I take those concerns really seriously. We want to build a safe space for all people and where love and trust... Anyways, what we really need is one of those real Viking ships. So let's create one. Oh shit, I used the wrong color mode. That's better. Try complaining to HR now, bitch. So I also drew our Viking ship in five different levels so it can be upgraded in the game. And now we need to do some coding to make it actually work. There we go. And now you can also upgrade the Viking ship level in the game. So now that we have our new and awesome boat, we need an actual enemy to raid. And this is the raid map with clans and villages to attack. Now these two clans were locked previously and that's totally not because I haven't implemented them yet. It's because other reasons. And since it might be a bit difficult to get all the way over there with that little rowboat, you also need to upgrade your viking ship to reach these new clans. Anyways, it's about time to implement these two clans as well. So let's get to coding. So once you defeat the evil bastards right here and upgrade your ship, you have a whole new continent to dominate. And I've only added the first three clans to fight against, all against other Vikings, but later clans should maybe be something a bit cooler. And let me know if you have any ideas. But I'm getting kind of tired of just being able to use melee weapons. So the plan has always been to add archers and mages as well. So we might as well get started with that. First, I drew some basic bow and arrow so I could start implementing things that I've been procrastinating for way too long because this means that I have to fix all the spaghetti code that past me created. Idiot. And you know what that means. It's coding time. Finally, now we have our very first bow which can be equipped and stays on a viking's back until you need it during the raid. I also added the very first basic bow and arrow attack that works perfectly. There we go. And then it's time to add mages. And now we have to answer one of the greatest questions known to mankind. What does mages use? Wands or staffs? Are the vikings more of a... Or a... And as a huge Harry Potter fan, I have no choice but to go for one. On second thought, let's do staffs. So now we can equip staffs as well and use them during the raid. But now I need your help. I just created archers and mages, but next up I need to create some cool and awesome abilities for them. If you have any ideas, please let me know. And want to see more awesome game features being implemented? Check it out right here. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.